Maybe it was inevitable that I was absolutely going to adore a Christmas film with Laurie Loughlin in it. But either way, I definitely did adore Homegrown Christmas. This is the latest of the Hallmark Christmas films that I've watched. And yes, I chose it because Laurie Loughlin is in it. There won't be any spoilers in this. So if you haven't seen the film, you are free to listen to me rambling on. But I definitely do recommend the film. So Homegrown Christmas was released in... 2018 and directed by Mel Damsky and written by Nina Wyman and as I said it stars Laurie Loughlin as Maddie and also Victor, Victor Webster as Carter Allen and I'll read the plot from IMDB I'm just making sure that there are no spoilers okay so I'm not going to read the plot I'm going to just summarize it so basically Maddie runs the, her own shoe company Mad Shoes and she decides to step down as CEO she sells this company and for one reason or another she decides to leave the city for Christmas and goes back to her home her childhood home with her family for the holidays but because she has been away for a long time her sister is distant she bumps into Carter, with whom she has a previous relationship, and things are a bit strained there. And the majority of the film is just about her trying to find her feet, work out where she's going, what she's meant to be doing, and also what's the most important thing. You know, is having this big successful business the most important, or are there are more important, more homely based things? It's a plot we've seen time and time again where people try and work out what's more important and certainly around Christmas with Christmas films this is something that comes up again and again but I didn't think it was boring I didn't think it was cliche was it predictable yes I would personally say it was predictable but when it comes to Christmas films I don't look for twists they're nice if they're there but they're not on my wish list for me I need Christmas decorations, I need Christmas coloured attire, I need snow where possible and this film basically ticks a lot of it. I think the homegrown name is really effective because there's a lot about this that feels really homely. There's a lot of baking of cookies or biscuits and you know a lot of family time but there's also a lot of times where there is no family time and there are issues there. So it's not just a pleasant, everything is perfect film. There are obstacles. It's not the most dramatic. But the narrative is very warm and fuzzy. Characters are great. I really love Maddie as a character. She doesn't try to pretend to be perfect. She is aware of her flaws. I think she's a very relatable character. And obviously Laurie Loughlin is fantastic. I didn't think it was overly romanticised like a lot of Christmas films. It got the balance between past romance, past family relationships and previous situations really quite spot on. We had some characters there who were not from Maddie's past so that it's not all reminiscing and nostalgia. There's a lot of kind of new things happening. I think they got the balance absolutely spot on. Visually it's, it's beautiful. It's an absolute delight. It does make me want to eat a lot of cookies bit of a downside but that tends to happen with Christmas films. There is nothing about homegrown Christmas that I do not like. It's got a 6.1 out of 10 on IMDb which I think is a fair rating. I feel like it should have more reviews. I feel like more people need to see it and review it. I have also just realised in reading the IMDb page that Laurie Loughlin is also in the Christmas film Every Christmas Has a Story. So that may well be the next one that I'm watching. Absolutely adored it. Really such a good fun film. It's about an hour and a half. You know, have a hot chocolate, sit under a blanket, get cosy and watch this. It's it's magical and I love it. <laughs>